Okay, we're back. Um, yeah, again, I, I don't really want to make this really long, so... And of course, what do I do? I pick, I waste a lot of time just looting everything. I think, well, that's, it's still worth a hundred gold though. Yeah, so, and of course now, apparently, I am over-encumbered. I'm not sure if I should start dropping some crap that I don't need, or if I should just, uh... Don't remember if I have that book or not, so I'm just going to grab it anyway. If I do have it, I can always just sell it. I mean, it's not that big of a deal. So I'm just going to explore a little bit here. Um, I do have a couple strength potions that I could use to bring my encumbrance up a bit, but probably still going to have to use the console just to be able to fast travel out of here once we're done. So, um, normally I, I have the one-handed sword and a shield, but I also typically carry a bow with me too, just for range, uh, like range attacks or whatever. But since, uh, they kind of wanted you to only take so much for this quest, I just took my sword and my shield, as well as my armor and a bunch of potions. Looking back, I probably didn't need them truthfully, but, oh well. I might release these people in a minute. Let's see, is there anything I really don't need? Well, technically that iron dagger. Probably those hunting bows as well. Don't really need them that badly. Guess I might as well get rid of the really crappy clothes. So truthfully, I don't need them. I'm going to keep the party boots and the party clothes just as a, basically a souvenir from my adventures in here. So I know I don't have to, but... I figure why not. Let's do it. So I'm curious about something here. Oh. Okay. Okay. Um, I guess you really do have to release that guy. I wasn't a hundred percent sure. I told you, I don't know anything else about it. What? Who? What? What do you want then? Yeah, sure. Uh, okay. Come on, this way. I've seen the guards use it to get rid of bodies. It must lead somewhere. I damn well hope so. If it helps you twist them up, I'm glad to help. They're after some old guy named Esburn. Something to do with dragons. I gathered it from listening to them talk when they thought I was out. I've seen a guy in Riften who they seem to think is him. Not much to go on. I don't even know where he lives or his name. But they seem pretty excited about it. That's it. Now, let's get out of here. Whatever you 
you want. But let's go now. If I remember right, there is some uh Falmore that come after you. You're trapped in here, and we have your accomplice. Surrender immediately, or you both die. Never mind. Silence. I'm dead off. Never should have come here. <laughs> Damn you. So Yeah, I think with this um Well, yeah, I'm not even going to loot that one. I mean, that's not bad. I mean, I collected it from every, pretty much everybody except for it. Um, Alright, I guess you could say I collected all the gear from everybody except for them, but oh well. Okay, so where's that other guy? Okay, there he is. So if, I'm, if I remember right, there's a frost troll down here. And I have never been able to save the people that you're, you're kind of escorting. I mean, maybe if you're really quick, I don't know. I wonder what kind of, um, oh, okay, and of course, I dropped the only bows that, that I had, alrighty. This might be the very first time I've ever killed this guy without uh, losing one of the NPCs. Because usually I, I have always left, lost the NPCs. I have never been able to save them. So this will be kind of a first time for me. So kind of cool that I got it recorded at least. Oh yeah, okay. I mean, I would grab that Curious Jam, but the problem is I'm not going to be doing the uh, Thieves Guild quest line on this character, so... But I am going to grab this book, just because it's a uh, skill book. But these unusual gems are having to do with a Thieves Guild quest, if I, mem if I remember right. And I'm not going to do the Thieves Guild with this character, so there's... It would just be cluttering up my inventory. I mean, it's it's not like it really uh, takes up that much, like, it takes any weight or anything, but... When you're trying to go for your inventory and you have, like, 20,000 things in it, you know, it's, it's a little overwhelming. But anyway, um... I guess that's pretty much it. Uh, oh wow, I forgot that they put you all the way up here. Forgot all about that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back to Delphine, Delphine or whatever her name is, talk to her, and then we're gonna call this a video. So hopefully people enjoyed this. Oh, and of course. Good day, friend. Keeping well? Huh. Looks like Cario is back following me again. You look like a traveler. If anyone sneaks up on us... I will shoulder some of your burden. I always kind of liked him. He, maybe it's just me, but he kind of sounds like Puss in Boots from Shrek. 
the I don't know who voices this um who voices Cario, but I always thought he was kinda cool, so he's he's my favorite follower in the game. I'm not usually a big fan of followers, but I don't mind Cario. I think he's kinda cool. So I'm just gonna give him all my stuff for now. And I'll sell it all later. Just giving them all my books. Um, I don't know if that mod is available on Xbox or on PS4, but I have a mod that makes all the gems uh, weigh nothing. So it's kind of sweet. It's just kind of a minor little thing, but yeah, I like it. Yeah, I don't know what the loading times are like on the Xbox One and the uh, PS4, but on my computer, which isn't really that amazing by any means, um, loading times are pretty quick, so you gotta love it. Really? That seems hard to believe. You're sure about that? Esbern? He's alive? I thought the Thalmor must have got him years ago. That crazy old man. Figures the Thalmor would be on his trail, though, if they were trying to find out what's going on with the dragons. You mean aside from wanting to kill every blade they can lay their hands on? Esbern was one of the blade's archivists, back before the Thalmor smashed us during the Great War. He knew everything about the ancient dragon lore of the blades. Obsessed with it, really. Nobody paid much attention back then. I guess he wasn't as crazy as we all thought. Ironic, right? The old enemies assume that every calamity must be a plot by the other side. Even so, we've got to find Esbern before they do. He'll know how to stop the dragons if anybody does. Do they know where he is? Riften, eh? Probably down in the Ratway, then. It's where I'd go. You'd better get to Riften. Talk to Brynjol. He's well-connected. A good starting point, at least. Oh, and when you find Esbern, if you think I'm paranoid, you may have some trouble getting him to trust you. Just ask him where he was on the 30th of Frostfall. He'll know what it means. Yeah, so that's the end of Diplomatic Community. Um, Hopefully it wasn't too painful. Um, I'd like to thank any, everyone for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you guys later. Thank you again. Well, goodbye. <laughs>